DreAllDay.com. What's up, everybody? Dre Ball and DreAllDay.com. I want to talk about uh, your game preparation, your mental game preparation, going into a game. I know a lot of players had an issue of they don't really play as well in games as they do in practice or when they're playing with their friends or when they're just working out on their own. So what can you do before a game to get into that proper mind state? One of the most important things you got to do is instead of getting into a reactive mind state where you're back on your heels thinking, damn, what if I miss this layup or how am I going to know what play to run? Or what about the guy on the other team? What's he going to do? Or am I good enough to be playing out here? Put yourself in an aggressive mind state where you're going towards a situation where you're thinking to yourself, like, you got to tell yourself something like, all right, I'm going to get 10 rebounds this game, or I'm going to dominate this game because I'm the best player out here, or I got something to prove, and I'm going to come out here and show everybody that I'm good enough to be out here. You got to find out, you got to find something that you can tell yourself before you go out there on the court. This is what I'm going to do and a reason for you to do it, and that will motivate you. That will push you forward so that you're going forward and being aggressive about it instead of being reactive, letting things come to you and saying, damn, what am I going to do about this, this, and this? You're thinking about your coach, you're worrying about what your teammates saying, you're worrying about what people in the crowd are saying. Put yourself like, okay, now I'm going to come out here and dominate this game and everybody's going to see I'm good. This is what I'm about to do. I'm about to show everybody how good I am because I've been put in the work. You know, I earned my spot on this team. I'm supposed to be out here. That's the reason I got this uniform on, and I'm going to show them. That should work for you. See how it works and let me know how it go. Dre Ball and DreAllDay.com. It was a move used mostly by uh, Chris Paul. Where you put a spin on the ball in one hand. And you, can, you see I go behind the back, little jump stop as I put the ball around my back. And then I go.